MC Banks is called Sunday Matthew by real names. Grew up with uh, basically on mama's side, wanting to be one of the best personalities in the country in the entertainment industry. MC Banks is a CEO for MC Banks Uganda Media. Basically, it is an online blog dealing in news and everything. We disseminate everything. Uh, I have a project called Talent Initiative Uganda. Uh, this project deals in bringing talents, bringing out talents from the people. Basically, we deal with the youth. You have seen me in ghettos, doing charities, looking for talents. Uh, because I do believe that someone can use his inner talent to renovate the community, to change the community, to inspire others. Competition is a next thing. But me as MC Banks, I beat out my competitors because I identify myself as a unique character. First of all, I believe that everything is possible as MC Banks, and uh, I don't devalue it. I work very hard towards to achieve the goal. If I say MC Banks needs to be this, trust me, I will do whatever it takes to be whatever. My competitors. I bring them pictures. I love them. They are my business partners. And in the way of bringing them close, I read their minds. The MC job is funny. Sometimes uh, you go to MC. You know, we have a lot of audience. There are people who love what you're speaking, but they don't love the person. When we talk about challenges, every job is faced by a challenge. But actually, in MC job, we have a challenge of competition. That's a very big challenge. Then we have a challenge of audience. Like some audience are so stubborn. MC, you get so close to people. You enter into people's mind. Eh? To extend that, even when you do anything wrong, people will follow that. As as a leader, you as you act their role model, you be their role model. People they start following you, they start to do what you do. You know? So that's a very big challenge. People relating my social media life, people relating my celebrity life to my to their life, to their normal life. The challenge of the audience. Sometimes you don't know what the audience really. You as an MC, you do what you think is right. That's a very big challenge. In addressing that challenge, you deal interactively with the audience. Basically, our aim as Talent Initiative Uganda, uh, we have we fight HIV, not fight HIV, school dropouts, smoking. So we look for different ambassadors who can help us fight HIV. Who can help us tell people to stay in school, my kids? Who can help us tell people that early sex has nothing to do with your future? Cigarette smoking is actually too bad. So when I when we go back down there in schools, we get people, we get kids who have talents. You can be a dancer, you can be a singer. So you use your talent. You can you can create a song or compose a song that, that's against making a change. So use your talent to influence someone to do something. You know artists are the face of the community. They are our role models. Most people love artists. So if you get a following and people love what you are doing, I do believe that inside you you can do something to influence someone. Love them. When we are down there in schools, basically, we have talents that we go to look for. We want the dancers, we want people who can do poetry. That you can write a poem which is touching, which is entertaining, any kind of poem that can be published to people. We love that. Uh, we were looking for singers. Uh, we were looking for comedians. You can do something fun and entertain people. You can do something influential in comedy which can attract the audience. We are looking for this program. We go in their schools to look for 
positions. Basically, we first send in letters to different schools to look for to, to look for a position to allow us to do a talent show in their school. Teachers, they think that the things of talent show, talent search, basically they are for illuminati people. We have people, another challenge, people think that it's for a bad cause. Like at some artists have created a bad name to the whole industry. They think when we bring our music system, children will take cigarettes, children will take alcohol, they will dance to burn a bit. That's a very big challenge. But it's later addressed when we post the show. Then we have a challenge of the And then it's a small team. Less money, less support. So we have a challenge of manpower as well as financial challenge. When spotting a talent, we consider someone's confidence in the stage. How do you address the questions? How do you reply? How do you connect with the select in the public? Because basically, we do for that. Uh, when we vote you as uh, an ambassador for talent initiative. School. We follow you up. We put spies to see what you do. Behind that initiative, behind the show, what do you do? Are you a cigarette smoker? Uh, do you do, what do you do basically behind the cameras? So, the way you present yourself to the judge, the way you conduct yourself in public, determines your talent. Oh, actually, I'm inspired by music. Inspired by helping people, and that is actually we do helping. Actually, what I didn't tell you, we don't only go to schools. We also go to ghettos. We go see people in the ghetto. We do charity works and starting initiative. So I'm inspired by that heart of helping, that that heart of loving someone to be in a good state. And I'm inspired by my audience. Sometimes my audience push me to come in. I really no, I'm really not aware of. Okay? So my inspiration to talent search is drawn from the available resources. And on top of that, I'm inspired by my sweet mom. Sweet mom always pushes me to do that. He told me, my son, go with dance to the world. Go become a master. So he, she inspires me a lot to do talent search. Besides talent initiative, I go in schools to look for jobs. I do marketing. When you find me in a, an overall, you may think this guy is a technician basically in that field. When you, may you find me holding a hole deep down at home, Cultivating a land, you say this guy is a farmer. So what am I trying to mean here? For survival, be flexible. Try everything that's around. Try any any chance that comes around. Those that are our more. My brother, my sister, if you're given a place, please, please, and please, at least try and pray. I'm doing marketing. I'm getting money. I'm doing marketing. I'm getting money from my And I don't get it all, but at least I receive what I want in marketing. A dream chaser is a person who is determined to follow his abilities, his desires, or her desires to reach to a destiny. Remember, I, I, I have a saying that. Determination determines your destiny. As a dream chaser, I think this is could be a person who wakes up early to chase or to look for what he or she desires. 